Hi everyone. My name is Vijay Pal. I am, and this is my first YouTube video, which I am going to play. Means uh, I'll make the video for the question for the previous year question paper that I held in Embos Board, that is the Meghalaya Board of Education. This is the previous year question question paper solution for 2018 yes in meghalaya uh, in 2018 a new syllabus came and which is continuing now so for that i'll start from 2018 only so let us see the solution of 2018 in science and technology subject so in section A, it is physics, which has came for 26 marks in 2018. Now, first these three questions are MCQs, but here I have written only the answers. So let us see it. Number one, with respect to the objects. The real image is it will be inverted when the ray light travels from a rarer medium to a denser medium obliquely. Number A it bends away from the normal. This is a question from refraction. Number 3 the coil of electric kettle is made up of necron because it has higher resistivity now question answers short question answers question number four define magnification of a lens the ratio of height of image and the object uh, and that of objects or ratio of distance of image and distance of object gives magnificence. Look, what is magnification of a length? It is the ratio of the height of the image, the original Im means the image formed height and that of the object's ratio means the ratio of the image to the object ratio or we can say that the ratio of distance of the objects from the mirror to the distance of the object from the mirror means the object will be formed uh, the object will stand in one side and the image will form whether it will be formed in the inner side of the mirror or uh, it will show in the outer side of the mirror in the opposite side of the object but we have to take the ratio of the of both of them then we will get the magnification of the uh, lens now question number 5 name the li light sensitivity of color sensitive cells present in the retina of a human eye look rods and cones are the light sensitivity of color sensitive cells present in the retina of the human eye respectively means here for the light sensitive cells they are rods and for the color sensitive cells they are cones in the retina now in question number six what is magnetic field the area around the magnet where the influence of the magnet can be experienced is called magnetic field. The area where we can experience the magnetic field means when two magnets will come closer at a particular distance, they will attract each other or they will repel each other. That area is called the magnet. That area where this attraction and uh, repulsion is going on, that area is full of uh, magnetic lines. That 
due to that we can experience the magnet uh, magnetization so that area that area is known as magnetic field now question number 7 state the law of reflection refraction of light this is not the reflection this is refraction the law of refraction of light uh, the incident ray refracted ray and the normal ray to the interface of the two media at a point of incidence all lie on the same point same plane means the incident ray refracted ray and the normal ray will lie on the same plane means on the uh, where the object is there where the media media is there number two the ratio of the sign of an angle of incidence to the sign of an angle of refraction is a constant this is also known as Snell's law of refraction means the sign means uh, we, uh, we have studied in maths the in trigonometry that cos sign that sign the ratio of sign of an angle of an incidence to the sign of the angle of refraction will be constant now define power of the lens power of a lens is defined as reciprocal of focal length of the lens now power of lens means the power of a lens is defined as reciprocal of the focal length means if the focal length is f then the power will be 1 by f name the instrument used for measuring a power of a lens for measuring a power power of a lens we use diptometer says diopterometer uh, is an instrument used for making the power of a lens now what is myopia how is it corrected myopia is correct uh, caused by the shape of the eyes either the eyeball is slightly too long or the cornea is too steeply curved then myopia is corrected by concave lens by wearing concave lens we can uh, correct the myopia number nine how much work is done in moving a charge of three column across two points having a potential difference 15 volt this is a numerical so in solution what are given the moving charge there is q is given as three column then the potential difference between two points is given as 15 volt so work done is what work done equal to moving charge into the potential difference between the two points so w equal to q into v so the q uh, the value of q is 3 and the value of v is 15 so if we put it uh, put it respectively then after the multiplication we got work done equal to 45 joule now joule what is joule joule is the unit of work done so we have written the unit of work done is joule so we have written joule and 10 give the type of mirror which is used as a rear view mirror in a car give two region now the side mirror of the car which is also known as rear view mirror what type of mirror we use there we use concave mirror yes in answer we can look at the concave mirrors are used in the rear view mirrors of motor vehicles and the two regions are 
they form the concave mirror form virtual erect and diminished image respective to of distance of the object concave mirror helps the driver to view large area of the traffic behind him now what is electric motor electric motor is a device that converts electrical energy to mechanical energy explain the different ways to induce current in a coil the different ways to induce current in a coil of wire are by moving the coil relative to a fixed magnet by keeping the coil fixed and moving a magnetic a magnet relative to it number 12 name a substance used most exclusively for making filaments of electric bulb that is tungsten metal tungsten metal is used ex exclusively for making a filament of electric bulb because it has a very high melting point if a metal doesn't have a high melting point then what will happen in an electric bulb when the electric bulb will heat up they'll melt and we'll say that and the fuse has gone but the tungsten metal has a high melting point so it takes much longer time to melt that's why we use tungsten metal name the factor affecting the resistance of a conductor now for uh, this uh, resistance what are the factors the resistance of a conductor depends upon the uh, upon the uh, upon, uh, uh, depend on the following factors that the temperature of the conductor whether the uh, conductor is heat up or cold or normal according to that the resistance will work the cross sectional area of the conductor the cross sectional area means we can say the uh, thickness of the conductor then the length of the conductor how much long the conductor is and the nature of material of the conductor nature of material of the conductor is also a very important point now define resistivity of a substance resistivity of a substance is defined as an electrical resistance of a substance of unit cross sectional area and unit length means when a resistance of a substance will be one, the cross section element the thickness will be 1 meter square or 1 cm square and the length will be 1 meter or 1 cm respectively then it will be say as resistivity of a substance now uh, write the formula for equivalent resistance when three resistance r1 r2 r3 are connected in parallel means here yeah, three resistance are given and connected in parallel so simply we will use the formula that is the formula of a equivalent resistance will be a uh, 1 by 1r plus uh, sorry r1 plus r2 plus r3 and if you connect in series then it will be directly r1 plus r2 plus r3 the relation between the parallel and series connection is reciprocal means in series it will be like r1 r2 r3 and in parallel which is given in this question it will be 1 by r1 plus r2 plus r3 that is the resistivity of a resistance now what do you mean by electromagnetic induction the flow of induced current 
in a coil when a magnetic field changes in a region of a coil this phenomena is known as electromagnetic induction now what is earthing why is earthing of electrical appliance necessary by earthing we mean that the metallic body of an electrical appliance is connected to a thick wire of copper which is buried deep in the earth and at its end is a copper plate surrounded by a mixture of charcoal and common salt now earthing of electrical appliance is necessary because it is necessary to avoid any shock when a metal causing of a appliance happen to touch the live wire the current due to short circuiting flows on the earth instead of uh, instead of flowing through the human body now in number c again a numerical has given a 200 watt bulb is lighted up for 2 hours how much energy is consumed now we have to find out the energy consumed then here yeah, what are the what are given a power is given of 200 watt and it have work for means lighted up for 2 hours 2 hours means if we convert it into second then it will be 7200 seconds because the assigned unit of time is second so we have to convert it into second so energy is uh, the formula of energy is power into time means the product of power and time consumed so if we multiply 200 watt into 7200 second then it will come a uh, 14 lakh 40000 joule so at down we have written 1.44 into 10 to the power 6 joules this uh, this answer is in the standard form so as we uh, as i have told the joule is a si unit of there that is work done there it is energy work done when we will do work when we uh, use energy after that we can do work so work done and energy is almost same it depends on the condition or the situation means the formula uh, means the si unit is same it is joule for energy also it is joule and for work done also it is joule now write any three difference between a convex a, a convex lens and a concave lens the difference between concave and convex lens are convex lens are known as converging lens it converge whereas concave lens are known as diverging lens convex lens are thicker at the middle and concave lens are thicker at the edge convex lens are thinner at the edge and concave lens are thinner at the middle so again a numerical from the uh, light chapter that is find the power of a concave lens of focal length 2 meter here what are given the focal length which is 2 meter yes uh, as this one is uh, focal length of concave lens so we will take as minus 2 meter the focal length will be minus 2 meter because it is concave lens it if it was a convex lens that will be only 2 meter that is plus 2 meter but due to concave lens we will take as minus 2 meter so we have to find out the power as i have told the power is the reciprocal of focal length so power equal to 1 by focal length that is 1 by 
minus 2. 1 by, uh, we know that 1 by 2 means 0 0.5. So, there is minus. So, minus 0 0.5 d of 3. Yeah, so, we know that the uh, unit of power uh, power is d of 3, power of length. So, the answer uh, here, the, uh, the numerical answer is 0 0.5 d of 3. Now comes to the chemistry part that is section B which come uh, which come for 26 marks means so uh, which has came for 24 uh, 26 marks now which of the following is a bronsted lorry acid according to the MCQ questions this is also MCQ questions uh, according, uh, from the four given options uh, the number number D there is H2O the H2O is the Bronsted lorry acid number 15 uh, the organic compound containing CHO group is aldehyde which of the following metal is the most abundant in the earth crust that is aluminium what do you mean by the term metallurgy now what is metallurgy the various processes involved in the extraction of a metal a metal from its ore and then refining the of metal including study of its properties and use are collectively known as metallurgy. Now what is rancidity? The oxidation of food materials such as uh, such that they become stale and start smelling is called rancidity why does color of copper to sulfate solution changes when iron nail is dipped in it the color of the copper solution uh, cop copper sulfate solution become light color after dipping the iron nail for 20 minutes it is due to the reduction of copper ion that got displaced by the more active metal iron because iron is more reactive than copper so iron is replaced copper and became iron sulfate plus copper uh, Cu plus 2. Write the use of sodium hydrogen carbonate. The two use uh, the two use of sodium hydrogen carbonate, that is the baking soda, are it is used for making unsinkable wool. It is used for manufacturing of chloroform. What do you mean by cracking of alkane? Name two types of cracking. Cracking is a name given to breaking up large alkane molecule into smaller and more useful bits. This is achieved by using high pressure and temperature without a catalyst or low temperature and pressure in the presence of catalyst. For example, here we can look that. Uh, C15 H32 is converted to uh, two molecule of C2 H4 plus C3 H6 plus C8 H18. The two types of cracking are thermal and catalytic cracking. Question 21. Uh, define displacement reaction give examples when a, when a more active elements replace the less active elements from an aqueous ionic compound the reaction takes place is called a chemical displacement reaction uh, sorry I have not given the example the example for, uh, for example we can say that uh, in the above, uh, we have studied this uh, copper sulfate or a copper sulfate solution uh, react with 
iron then the iron has replaced means you can say the iron has uh, displaced the copper and form iron sulfate and the copper uh, and the copper became uh, and the copper has released alone now state mental its periodic law a tabular chart representing a systematic arrangement of element in order of the increasing atomic mass is called mendelip periodic law uh, sorry uh, mendelip periodic table what is hydrocarbons carbons of uh, compounds of carbons in which their molecules are composed of carbon and hydrogen atom are called hydrogen carbons for example methane ethane propane etc give the iupac name of ch3cooh the iupac name of ch3cooh is acetic acid I write down the structural formula of methanic acid the structural formula of methanic acid is uh, the formula is ch2o ch2o2 no? and the structure is given in the site that c at the middle double bond at the upper one side is hydrogen and another side is oh this one is the structural formula of methanic acid what is mean by refining of metals name four methods commonly used for refining of impure metals the process by which impurities are removed from an ore to obtain pure metals by the process of refining the four methods commonly used for refining of pure metals are roasting calcination liquefaction and electrolytic refining no what do you mean by period and group of a periodic table the vertical columns are known as the group and the horizontal columns are known as the periods is the period uh, in the periodic table how does the valency of an element change on moving down the group and on moving left to right of the group so the valency remains same in going down the group the valency first increase from 1 to 4 and then decreases 4 to 0 in the going from left to right of the period in the periodic table now what is monoacidic Uh, monoacidic base and diacidic base give two example of each a monoacidic base is a base that produces one hydroxide ion when one of its molecules undergo complete ionization for example sodium hydroxide a diacidic base is a base that produces two hydroxide ion when one of the molecule undergoes complete ionization for example barium hydroxide now what is redox reaction give example the reaction in which oxidation and reduction re, uh, reaction occurs simultaneously are called redox reaction for example here copper oxide plus hydrogen will give copper plus water this one is a redox reaction in the given reaction copper oxide is reduced to copper by losing oxygen thus copper undergoes reduction hydrogen is oxidized to water by gaining hydrogen oxygen atom what is neutralization 
Neutralization is a reaction where an acid reacts with the alkali to form a neutral solution of a salt and water. Give any two use of ethanoic acid. The two use of ethanoic acid uh, in a rubber and the silk industry uses preservatives. What are semi metals? Name any two semi metals. A semi metal is a material with a very small overlap between the bottom of the conduction band and the top of the valence band. The two semi uh, metals are boron and silicon. What, uh, what so you mean? Uh, what do you mean by ionization energy? What are the factors which determine the magnitude of ionization of energy? Ionization of energy is the amount of energy required to remove an electron from an isolated atom or molecule. The factors are size of the positive nuclear energy. As the nuclear charge increases, its attraction for the outermost neutron increases and more energy is required to remove an electron. Then size of an atom. The distance of outermost electron from the nucleus. Screening, which is also known as shielding effect of inner shell electron. That is the phenomena of reduction of nuclear force of attraction due to the inner shell electrons towards valence electron. Now comes to the biology part. Uh, this will be section C, not B. Here, same, the first three question is MCQ. So, which of the following cells are formed in the bone marrow? There are four options. Among them, uh, the RBCs is the correct answer. Hormone which controls cellular metabolism is testosterone. Bryophyllum plants produce vegetatively by leaf bud. Name the male and reproductive uh, male. Uh, name the male and female reproductive role of a flower. The male reproductive role of flower is androsium or stamen, we can say. And the female reproductive role of a flower is gynosium or pistil. Name the plant which concerned with transport of water and food materials. The plant tissue concerned with transport of water is xylem and food is phloem. Now, define heredity. Heredity is the transmission of traits from one generation to the following generation. Distinguish between breathing and respiration. Any two points. The two differences between breathing and respiration are breathing consumes energy whereas respiration it releases energy in the form of ATP. Breathing is an extracellular process means that we are inhaling and exhaling is a breathing process whereas respiration, uh, respiration is a intracellular process means it takes place inside the cell. Name the structures that helps in excretion of uh, excretion in tapworm, earthworm, cockroach, and human beings. As the structures of, of, uh, of excretion in tapworm is fem cell, in earthworm is nephridia, in cockroach is malphidium tub, uh, tubules, and in human we know as it is kidneys. Uh, then uh, define uh, define photosynthesis. Write the overall reaction of the photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is the process uh, in which autotrophs take raw materials from the environment that is carbon dioxide and water and convert them into carbohydrates or glucose in the presence of sunlight 
and chlorophyll and the overall reaction is this six, uh, six molecule of carbon, uh, carbon dioxide and six molecule of hydrogen uh, water and react in the presence of carbon dioxide and water uh, sorry in presence of uh, in presence of sunlight and chlorophyll it gives a glucose molecule and uh, six uh, a glucose molecule and six molecules of oxygen now what is reproduction name the different types of reproduction reproduction is the fundamental features of all living organisms and is a biological process by which living organisms produce offspring of similar uh, that is similar to them there uh, there are two types of reproduction that are sexual uh, asexual and sexual reproduction differentiate between homologous and analogous organ in homologous organ they show similar anatomy and in analogous structure they show dissimilar anatomy in hom homologous there is dissimilar function but in analogous there is similar function in homologous the uh, they develops a relate uh, uh, develops in a relative species, uh, species and in analogous this develops in unrelated species and name the three major division of human brain which is the most prominent part of the brain the three major division of human brain are forebrain midbrain and hindbrain the most prominent part of the brain is the cerebrum present in the forebrain what do you mean by reflex action reflex action are automatic mechanical and intermediate response to harmful stimuli uh, now differentiate any three points between anaerobic uh, aerobic and anaerobic respiration the three points between aerobic and anaerobic respiration are aerobic respiration can perform in the presence of oxygen whereas anaerobic respiration perform in the absence of oxygen aerobic respiration gives us carbon dioxide water and energy whereas anaerobic respiration releases ethanol carbon dioxide and energy aerobic respiration occurs in aerobic organisms whereas anaerobic respiration occurs in anaerobic organisms now differentiate between sensory and motor nerve cell sensory neurons are unipolar uh, unipolar motor neurons are multipolar uh, sensory neuron are comprised of short axon and motor neuron are comprised of long axon what is ultra filtration ultra filtration is a process of a filtration of blood in a glomerulus under great pressure during which the liquid part of the blood <coughs> write down the full form of aids write down any two preventive methods of aids the full form of aids is acquired immune deficiency syndrome the two preventive methods of aids are prevent blood transfusion from an affected person use condoms during intercourse with your partners write down any three digestive functions of liver the three digestive functions of liver are bile from a liver secreted helps uh, secreted helps in digesting fat and some vitamins the liver also detoxifies potentially harmful chemicals it takes the raw material absorbed by the intestine and makes all the various chemicals your body need to function now differentiate between saprophytic and parasitic nutrition parasitic nutrition when the 
A species derived its food from other living things without killing it are called parasites. And in saprophytes, the mode of nutrition in which organisms obtain nutri uh, nutrition from dead and decaying matters are called saprophytic nutrition. In parasitic nutrition, it is uh, intracellular digestion system. But in saprophytic, it is extracellular digestive system. For example, in parasitic, plasmodium, cascuta and, bac cascuta and bacteria. But in saprophytic, it is fungi. Why is blood red in color? We know this due to the presence of hemoglobin. We are studying this from the smaller class. Give any four function of limb. Uh, as we have blood, uh, there is another white color fluid that is limb. The four function of limb are it supplies nutrition and oxygen to those parts where blood cannot reach. It drains away excess tissue fluids. Limb returns proteins to the blood from the tissue space. Fats from the intestine are also absorbed through the limb. The limb also re removes bacteria from tissue. Now distinguish between real image and virtual image. A real image is always inverted whereas virtual image is always erect. The virtual image cannot be projected onto a screen while a real one can. What is lens? Name the two types of lens. A lens is defined as the portion of a transparent optical material having one or two spherical surface. The two types of lens are concave and convex lens. Define electric power and its SI unit. The rate of doing electric work or amount of electric work done in one second is called power, that is electric power. The SI unit of electric power is Watt. What is conductor? And give example. The substance through which electricity can flow are called conductors. The two examples cop uh, are copper and aluminium. What do you mean by atmospheric refraction? The refraction of light caused by the earth's surface having air layer of varying optical densities is called atmospheric refraction. Now what is decomposition reaction? Give an example. When a chemical compound decomposes so as to form two or more substances then the chemical reaction is called a decomposition reaction. Now define out oh, there uh, there is um, means uh, what is decomposition reaction and give example but here same again I didn't give the examples that is my mistake. As in the decomposition, this uh, decomposition reaction, I have given a uh, reaction in this one mm, cracking of alkanes. There, one example is there, means the reaction of alkane that is breakout. That reaction is can also be a decomposition reaction. Now, come to define activity series of metal. The arrangement of metal in a vertical column in the decreasing order of their chemical acti uh, reactivities is called the activity series of metal. Name the metal that has the highest melting point and lowest melting point. Tungsten has the highest melting point 
and the mercury has the lowest melting point as mercury is a liquid in the room temperature we know that that is used in the thermometer give to use of sodium carbonate the two use of sodium carbonate are it is used in the manufacturing of glass soap and paper it is used in the manufacturing of sodium compounds like borax which process are used for the enrichment of sulfide ore and oxide ore in sulfide ore it is used the froth floating method and oxide ore it it used the magnetic separation name to allotropes of carbon the two allotropes of carbon are diamond and graphite write down the iupc name of c2h5oh that is ethanol now differentiate between self pollination and cross pollination uh, self pollination it is the transfer of pollen from the anther of the stigma in the same flower of or pollen is transferred from the anther of the one flower to the stigma of the another flower on the same plant and in cross pollination it is a transfer of pollen from an anther of a flower to the stigma of the flower of another plant no. what is excretion named any two nitrogenous waste product excretion is the process by which organisms repel metabolic waste products and other toxic substances from their body the major two nitrogenous waste are urea and uric acid differentiate between systemic circulation and pulmonary circulation pulmonary circulation carries deoxygenated blood from heart to lungs and oxygenated blood back to the heart whereas systematic circulation carry oxygenated blood from the heart throughout the body and deoxygenated blood back to the heart write down the difference between dominant gene and recessive gene when an allele is dominant the characteristics it is con connected to will be expressed in the n individual when the allele is recessive the characteristics it is connected to it uh, it is less likely to be expressed give to example of reflex action in our daily life activities the two example of reflex action are when light acts as a stimulus the pupil of the eye changes in size sudden jerky withdrawal of hand or leg when pricked by a pin name the following a small opening of the leaf struck uh, leaf surface the small opening of the leaf surface is the stomata that is present in the plant the duct which carries urine from urinary bladder to outside the body the duct which carries the urine from urinary uh, urinary bladder to the outside of the body is ureter so i have concluded my video and if you like this video please subscribe and like it i will subscribe it so that more further the i'll going to uh, i am going to upload the uh previous year question paper for 2019 20 in the coming days so you will get the link and you can see and you can practice the question answers as you know that many questions uh are common from the previous uh, previous year question I means um 
in the board exam of class 10 we get many questions that are common to the previous year question papers so we can uh, solve this and we'll be more prepared for the upcoming board exam uh, who are in the uh, class uh, means who are preparing for the board exam for the coming class 10 board exam so please subscribe it and like it like the button